Why do we do things that we enjoy? Simple question. Obviously because it makes us feel good. Why do we buy clothes? Because when we put them on, it makes us feel good about ourselves. Why is it that when we mix with our friends and our family, and we do it in a social occasion, um, it makes us feel good? They're the things that we tend to do that uplift us, give us that really good feeling about ourselves. So why is it that when we eat food that we know that's not really great for us, that a few minutes later, we feel pretty shit? But at the time, it's a great idea. It's a great idea to like have a drink, but then probably if we've overdone it the following day, we don't feel that great about ourselves. And I don't know about you, but um, I know that I speak to people who reach that point where they think, you know what, I'm missing days because it takes two, three days, whatever, to get over a major hangover, let's say, for example. But then we eat food and it sort of takes its toll on us, but it can sort of creep up and it can last for a long time. And what I mean by a long time is that if you're overweight, it's not one day you wake up overweight and then the following day you can go, right, okay, I'm gonna lose all this weight today. It doesn't work that way, as you well know. So when people come onto my program and they say, okay, I want some great results. And I say to them, well, it's not gonna happen overnight because chances are some of the stuff that you're doing now, it's become a habit, food that you eat, has become a habit. Drinks that you drink, they've become a habit. The things that you wait, you know, the things that you do in your life, the day-to-day -day stuff, they are habits. So to break those habits is not just gonna happen, bang, in an instance. I've heard people saying, you know, you can change in an instance. And while I believe that that's certainly true on, on many things, certainly when it comes to your health, I think that, certainly from experience, is that I've seen that that takes a little bit longer so this video today and the tip is is don't beat yourself up that you're not getting to where you really want to be as quick as you want to get there it takes time it takes support it takes knowledge from people around you who can help you with that support to say this is the right thing for you to do and let's track your progress and let's see how that's working because that's really really important if you haven't got someone there that's got your back, or if you haven't got someone there that's mentoring you, then that probably could be the next step for you. Especially if you've got a goal, and especially if you want to reach that goal, and you want to do it in a time that you've set yourself realistically. So the message today is don't beat yourself up, make that plan, work towards it. If you haven't got people around you that can help and support you, then find them, try and find them basically do whatever that you can to try and get those people on board and mix with those people because that's going to rub off those habits will change the more that you do them so guys have a great day look forward to speaking to you soon take care bye bye